In this video, I'm going to show you how you can white label your agency interactor account to have your own logo, your own branding and your own color scheme. So I'm going to go down to logo and this is where we add our logo. That's going to replace the logo that's down here and also on the login page. Now, for the sake of this demo, I'm going to use our video suite logo, which is loading up here. So our video suite logo is here. Now for the primary color, uh, we got a primary color, a secondary color, and a background color. So the primary color, I'm just going to use, uh, let's just guess, uh, you know, the type of purple that it is on there. Of course, you can, you know, play around with these to get it how you want it. The secondary color, let's use this kind of reddy orangey type color. The background color, um, let's just use a gray and we'll see how that looks. Uh, the page title is what goes across the top. So I will say uh, video suite up there. The page icon is the, uh, the favicon, which is up here. So again, if I minimize this and I'm gonna drag over this one down here to replace that. And all I'm going to do is click on save changes. Okay. And now this is saved. When we log into our custom site, it's going to change. If I go to app.videosuite.net, as soon as this loads, we can see uh, it's changed. So, you know, probably uh, want, to, want to change the background color, you know, the background color of the gray isn't the nicest color that you've uh, ever seen. Uh, but we've got our logo on here, you know, the purple over here, which is the primary color. If I uh, log in, if I can remember my login right now, we can see we have our logo down here on the bottom left. We have our favicon up here. We have our uh, you know, the button color. And again, you know, I'd, I'd want to change the color of this gray. Uh, what I'd probably do is change this gray as the background color. I'd have the main purple color and then have changed the purple to orange. So, you know, we'd have the nice purple here. I'd probably have a, you know, a different colored logo. So then we'd have the purple rather than the gray. And I'd have the, these button colors uh, as the primary color would be the orange. Um, so again, if I uh, change this and we'll copy this, paste it here and let's have the secondary color just as, um, you know, let's have a, a yellow. I'm gonna save the changes and when I refresh this you know we can see it's it's starting to look at, uh, to look better of course you can mess around with the colors uh, but this is how you add in your favicon your branding your logo to your interactor agency 